In this video, I'm gonna show you how to make this scrubber. And I think it's so cute and it's uh, a great size. It's perfect for scrubbing your veggies or scrubbing your skin or scrubbing the dishes and also really, really good substitute for the metal sponges. This is really, really good for cleaning very rough areas. Just put some soap on it or something. And it's great because it's uh, double layered so that it's gonna be easier to air dry. It's great for the skin, it's natural and it's very very cheap and easy and quick to make. So um, just stay tuned and I'll show you how to do this. I'm going to use some Yuta. I use this with my 4.5mm hook. You're gonna start off by making a slip knot. And then you're going to make four chains. One, two, three, four. Connect to a ring with the slip stitch in the first chain. Now you have your, your ring. Chain two, which is your first stitch. Now you're going to make 11 double crochet into the ring so you will have 12 stitches in total. And now you're going to connect with one slip stitch in the second chain, which was our first stitch. And now tighten and chain two, our first stitch. And now you're going to make two stitches into each of the stitches in the round. So I'm gonna make one more stitch into the same. Now we've made two double crochet in each stitch. So we finish with one slip stitch in the second chain. Now we're gonna make one more round and we start by chaining two, our first stitch. And then we make one, two, one, two, one, two, which means we make one double crochet in the first, two in the next, one, two, one, two, all the way down. So one, and then into the next we make two double crochet into the same stitch. Our last two double crochet in the last stitch. Finish with one slip stitch in the first, chain one. Now you can break off the yarn. And then you're gonna make one more identical to this. Okay, now I am back with my second round and I haven't broken off the yarn yet because I'm going to crochet these two together. I want the right side to face out, so I'm placing it like this. So we have the right side here and the right side here. And now we're going to crochet the two pieces together and I'm just going to crochet together with slip stitches into each stitch. So I'm going to find the first stitch on the other one and the first stitch here. And then I'm going to chain one first. And then go into the first stitch here and the first stitch here. When you've um, come back to the beginning, I think it's a good idea to just make a slip stitch into the first slip stitch just to connect the round so it looks nice on the edge. Then you're going to make the loop. So we're going to make one, two, three, four chains and we're going to go into the stitch both of the stitches here on the scrubber. Then you're gonna turn it over, so you crochet on the other side. And now we make single crochets. Just make them as tight as possible. And then um, you're going to make a slip stitch uh, just into the same hole. And then chain one 
and then you have the little loop here and just tighten that yarn end 